Hey guys, welcome back to Kalal Soups 808. So you might remember in a previous video, um, I previewed this upcoming PCS one-third scale JCBD statue. Um, and we've got some updates online. And holy f So yeah guys, um, this is what we were kind of promised uh, by PCS and I know, I know production doesn't always equal prototype, I get it, they're never going to be quite as perfect as the prototype but there should be something close. But these images here uh, surfaced online, I don't know who, who uh, took the photos but this is one of the production pieces in hand in the hands of a collector and it looks absolutely bugger all like the prototype. And here they are side by side. Obviously on the left is the prototype and then uh, the production piece on the right. Um, yeah, I don't know what to say. Uh, some people are going to defend this and say, oh, the picture on the right is taken on a crappy iPhone and crappy lighting. And But no, um, the point is it shows clearly enough that the piece that you're likely to get in hand is nowhere near uh, the quality of what we were promised, which matters. The picture on the left shows nice skin texture and like a tanned effect and wrinkles in the forehead showing a bit of expression. And uh, then the production piece just does not. It looks like it's been painted very cheaply uh, with not a lot of shading whatsoever. Just a really disappointing job, I'm afraid. Now this is a, a different picture from a different collector in, uh, in better light here, but you can tell the body sculpt is fantastic, but the paint on the body is just so flat and uh, not at all like uh, what we were expecting. But in fairness, this one looks a little bit better than the first images uh, we saw here. Um, so, yeah, it appears like there might be some uh, production inconsistencies. But then, because I like to keep things balanced, there's also images of somebody's Kurt Sloan or the Musai JCVD. Um, and, yeah, um, this looks better. It's taken in different lighting, like darker lighting, so it doesn't show up the, the pale skin as much. Um... But as you can see, it looks way more like the prototype than the Shotokan or uh, Frank Duke's kind of statue does. Although I don't think the hair on the production piece is anywhere near as well sculpted as on the prototype. It's uh, way too thick and uh, the lines in between the hair strands are uh, just not as good. It's, uh, it looks quite cheaply done, but the face sculpt is significantly better it seems. So yeah, I don't really know what's going on here, but I don't mean to take a, a dump on uh, PCS here. Um, I'm usually a, a fan of their work. Um, I just don't really know what's going on with uh, with this JCVD. Anyway guys, uh, what do you think? Um, has this uh, changed your mind on the piece? What are your thoughts? Am I being too harsh? Am I being fair? Comment below. And guys, if you like content like this, if you appreciate content like this and uh, found any value in this video whatsoever, please remember to hit that like button. It really helps out the channel. Also, if you're not subscribed already, feel free to subscribe. That way uh, you get more content like this recommended to you. And with that said, thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will catch you in the next video.